This short video will show you the installation of the Quantum Information National Laboratory's newly purchased quantum photonic processor. The staff of the Dutch quantum technology startup Quix Quantum instructed the experts of ELTE during the unboxing and installation via a conference call. Carefully packed components have been waiting for this moment in two black cases. The electronic control unit contains the optical chip itself and the electronics needed for manipulations. After removing the cover, we can finally take a look at the chip and the controlling electronics. Lifting the panel reveals the coolant tank that must be filled with coolant liquid right after delivery. The chip generates a lot of heat during operation. That is dissipated by the fans in the back of the control unit. The photon source, currently a 1550 nanometers superluminescence diode laser, is now in place. The photons are led into the fiber optic switch and then into the input channels of the photonic chip through optical cables. Finally, the output channels are connected to the photodiode array. The system is controlled by a classical computer. In the pre-installed Python environment, simple functions can be used to access all the functionalities of the photonic chip and perform pre-programmed measurements on the photodiode detectors. If you want to know more about the Quantum Information National Laboratory of Hungary, check out the video on the right.